So we would like to find an equation for the plane that is parallel to the plane uh, x plus y plus 2z is equal to 3 and also contains the point negative 1, 3, 2. There are two things that we should take into uh, consideration here. So first of all, in general, a plane uh, that contains the point x0, y0, z0 and has normal vector abc, normal means perpendicular, uh, has equation given by a times x minus x0 plus b times y minus y0 plus c times z minus z0 equals 0. Uh, the other thing that we should take into consideration is that if we have a plane, if we have the equation of a plane, so let's say something like uh, this, this is a generic equation of a plane, then, and as long as the x, y, z are all on the same side, then the coefficients of x, y, and z, so in this case, there would be 3, 1, and negative 4, give us a vector which is normal to the plane. In some sense, this is sort of reverse engineering on the previous equation that we gave, because you can easily notice that uh, AX, BY, and uh, CZ are going to be the corresponding terms that you will have, meaning ABC will be components of a vector which is normal uh, to the plane. So um, by combining these two facts, along with the fact that uh, parallel planes have the same normal vectors, uh, we see what the plan for this problem will be. So what we need to do is extract a normal vector from this plane, from the given plane, and then use it along with the point that is given to us in order to find the equation of uh, the plane that we're looking for. So let's solve this problem. So we start by noticing that uh, the plane uh, x plus y plus 2z has normal vector, a normal vector. The normal vector is not unique. Any uh, non-zero scalar multiple of a normal vector is also a normal vector. Uh, but in this case, we have one, one, two. And so now we have the vector one, one, two. We have the point negative one, three, two. We combine them together and we get one times uh, x plus one plus one times uh, y minus 3 plus, oops, sorry about this, plus two uh, z minus 2 is equal to zero. And it's perfectly fine to actually leave the equation like this. If we want to work it out a little more, then we will have x plus y plus 2z. And what are the constants? So we have 1 minus 3 is negative 2. And minus 4 is negative 6. So minus 6 is equal to zero. And this is the equation of the plane that we were looking for. Thanks for watching.